hello everyone in today's video i am going to discuss that how we can create views and how can we create indexes on the hive table and how can we create the partitions on the hive table uh, for running the hive we need to run the hadoop first of all and then we have also to start network server uh, basically we have installed our derby server so uh, for saving the time i have already started the hive so this is a hive looks now so i am showing you the databases first of all so there is one database named demo so i am going to use that demo database and then i will show you the tables it contains transactions table we will be working on this table so basically uh, this table contains uh, let me show you through this command to describe transactions table so it contains the user id customer name and country and order id so the corresponding data types are mentioned on the screen so now we will be creating another table which will be partitioned in nature and we will like to partition the all the transactions based on the country so let us uh, let's say there is one company which uh, have its transactions record and uh, it, that country uh, that company wants to separate the transactions according to different countries so for that uh, first of all uh, we have to set this dynamic partition mode to the non strict after that uh, we will be creating the country transactions table with these fields user id customer name and order id and basically the country field will be used to partition the table so i am running this after that i have to uh, load the data from transactions table into this table and partition this table at the same time so for that just write this command uh, insert overwrite table country transactions and we will be creating partitions based on country so and the data will be taken from the transactions table which is already existing which I have shown you here so basically jobs are running and it will take some time so now let's show the tables so the country transactions table have been made and we can uh, see this on local host 50070 so yes this country transactions table has been made and clicking on this table uh, basically this these tables are in this demo database which is under this directory user hive warehouse so and the country is equal to india and country is equal to usa two partitions have been made uh, because the transactions table was containing this data already so yes it contained these four records where uh, three of the records have the country set to india and one have usa so the two partitions have been made in this country transactions table so this is how we can uh, partition the table now we will see uh, how can we create the view on this table so for creating a view uh, we have this command create a view and then uh, the name of the view uh, and then the records which i need to uh, basically this is the query this view will show always so i am making the view a indian customer transactions so it will contain the transactions where country is equal to India and customer name starts with A. So this is for rejects matching. And I will be copying this command and running. 
on my head. So now let's show tables. Now this virtual table has been made. Basically, to drop this table, we will uh, use the command drop view and then uh, the name of this view. And for dropping the table, we have to run the command drop table. So, this is not actually the table, uh, but this is uh, we can say the virtual table. So, now let's do select star from a Indian customer transactions table so yes this contain only the transactions from india and now i will show you how to create index on this same table country transactions which is already partitioned in nature also so for that we need to run this command So basically we have to you know do the deferred rebuild and we have to mention this class also so basically this is the index name and this is the table name on which we need to create the index and this is the field or the column on which we need to uh, make the index so field here is user id so because and we are indexing the table on user id so now let's run this command so basically if i try to again make this index it will show me index already existing see this index id is user already existing